Welcome back to part 5. In this series, we're going to look at the wiring of the Saturn Viper. So simple, in fact, the wiring is done for you. When you look inside your casing, you have basically two flexes, a black flex and a white flex. The black flex is a permanent power supply. This comes from a 5 amp uh, fuse bore. And with a permanent power supply to the boiler, number one, you have um, frost protection uh, built into it. And number two, the fan on the burner has a pre born and post born function on it. Following on from the supply, we have a white flex, which is power supply for your circulating pump. As mentioned in the previous episode, the boiler will only circulate hot water. Also, on an example of one of the frost protection modes, it, the circulating pump, it, it activates. Now that we have power supply to the boiler and we have our circulating pump wired, we now need to give the boiler a heat request or give it a signal to come on. That signal is carried out on these two orange cables, which is a volt-free heat call. Effectively, it's a simple little switch. As soon as that switch closes, the boiler knows that there's a demand for heat and it starts to go into an uh, ignition phase. That's it, and the wiring of the boiler. As you can see, it's uh, very, very simple. Um, and uh, thank you very much for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in uh, part six.